for women's ready to wear. Hello. Hi, everyone. What a wonderful occasion we're here for, no? And I'd like to thank Margaret for having me here and her committee. And what, what perfection. Did everyone see the young lady bringing up the award with white gloves? Are you astounded at how chic that is? Margaret, bravo. All right. So you have many nominees. Obviously, you're told to hold your applause, but I'm not telling you that. The first nominee is Mr. Norman Ambrose. Norman is formal perfection with blunt intimacy. The resurrection of American couture makes this collection a standout. The second is Miguel Antoine, a great believer that design is in the details, inspired by daring individuality, punctuation, and modern flair. The third is Elaine Cassis, excuse me, Elena Cassis, composed of classic and timeless silhouettes with updated details made by a true dressmaker using superior fabrics to create staples for every woman. The fourth nominee is Joel Diaz and Christina LePance for jo Jobly, a woman's lifestyle brand focused on achievable luxury with master tailoring, innovative, innovative, innovative fabric treatments, and unique artistry. The fifth nominee is Wes Gordon. This collection makes ladylike luxury and craftsmanship relevant to a new generation. Timeless elegance and sophistication are met with youth and modernity. The sixth is Stacy Lohman of Stacy Lohman, New York. Fabric is the foundation for every collection. Unique textures and surface treatments complement the tough yet chic body confident aesthetic. The seventh is Neri Manavong and Alexandra Helfinger for NAM. The focus of their design collaboration is the shirt dress, with the collection finding inspiration in men's shirting details combined with feminine accents, fine fabrics, and innovative silhouettes. The eighth is Steve McDermott of Stevie Mac, New York. Globally influenced embroideries and themes expressed with the power, excitement, sex, and energy of New York City all served as inspiration. Good. Slide, number nine is Misha Nunu for Nunu. My design mission is to bring refined elegance of bespoke tailoring at accessible price points by partnering with local New York tailors. And the last and 10th nominee is Nara Paz Design of Nara, Nara Paz for Nara Paz Design International. Her inspiration is a passion for art that becomes translated into high fashion clothing to make women look and feel phenomenal. Wow. So, can all of the nominees please stand to be recognized? And you all deserve that, because getting this far is a plus, you know that. The winner is Oh, this feels like the Academy Award. We have a tie. <laughs> the winners are Wes Gordon for Wes Gordon and Misha Noonan for Noonan. This is so scary. Um, this is such an honor, and, uh, and thank you all so much, especially in this time as we're dealing with the craziness of getting ready for a show. Um, it's a great reminder that I'm so lucky to have a career that I absolutely love doing, and that when the clock hits midnight or one in the morning or it's Saturday or Sunday, you don't even notice. And I think many people in this room can say the same thing. So to be early in that career and to be recognized like this by all of you who I admire so much is amazing and I'm really, really grateful. Thank you so much. Well, congratulations to Wes as well. Um, but I would just like to say that I'm deeply, deeply honored and um, somewhat shocked. And um, I'd like to thank Fashion Group International and Margaret Hayes especially and um, 
all the people that voted for me as well, all the members. And um, I'd like to thank my team in New York for all their hard work and efforts because I couldn't do it alone. And I'd also like to thank my family and fiance for their continued love and support. Thank you. Congratulations to all of our winners and nominees and all of you. Come together for a picture and Margaret wants to make sure that you come back next year. Thank you all.